Donald Trump gets numbers that you and I do not get. And he gets them from uh, Republicans. And they tend to, I think, you know, they're trying to manage his expectations and they're trying to get him out in front of things. And look, they certainly thought that uh, Donald Trump was going to lose in 2016. It wasn't there was nobody coming to him at uh, noon or, or the night before the election saying, like, you got this, boss. So, I don't know, make of this what you will. But here is Donald Trump being interviewed by Sinclair Media. This is uh, his favorite non-Fox owner-operated quasi-network across the country. And um, he's asked if he regrets anything, which is... Now, also, just remember, like, this is like literally... The, you, you remember, did you ever see the Happy Days? where the Fonz couldn't say that he was wrong. Do you know what I'm talking about? He would say, I, I, and it's so, so dumb. I'm very so dumb, right? Fonz. But it's good. The I mean, Fonz if you're, is cooler, if you're though, 10, as as if you're 10, that's sort of funny. Uh, when you're older, you start, it's a little bit ridiculous. Okay, except for uh, our president does that. And uh, he doesn't do it with just like not being able to pronounce words, but he does it in, in like, he'll take two or three words to do that. Talk to me about, this is something that I asked your predecessor about during his term. I asked President Obama, so I'll ask you the same thing. Is there anything, as you look back at your first almost two years, that you regret, that you wish on you, that you could just take back and redo? Well, there would be certain things. I'm not sure I want to reveal all of them, but I, I would say tone. Uh, I would like to have a much softer tone. I feel to a certain extent I have no choice. But maybe I do, and maybe I could have been softer from that standpoint, but I want to get things done. We've had <laughs> tremendous victories on trade. We've had tremendous victories on so many different things. Uh, on our military, you look at what we've done with rebuilding the military. But I would say if there's anything, I think tone would be perhaps something. I'm not sure that if I did that, maybe I'd be swamped, okay? You know, swamped meaning with the other side, because I wouldn't say that tone's been so nice either. But that would be something I would uh, say that I'll be working on. There you go. Tone. But I would Swamped uh, meeting uh, with the other side. Do it. I mean, because they would take advantage of me. I made a mistake about tone, but it's probably not my fault. You know, it probably wouldn't be. And even if I did it differently, it would be their fault because everybody's unfair to me. But perhaps, I don't know. And I'm also going to sort of awkwardly turn my body right now. I mean, like, like you mentioned 10 year old tone. and he does look like he's at some function that he doesn't want to there was maybe a thing that I something should... I did wrong I would say the amount of conditional <laughs> statements in there no, the proof I, is I, in the pudding what got, happens tomorrow I got flashbacks to grammar like you underline the conditional statements like I, I'm going to see if we can go through this just quickly again Nerd um, here, one second no, I, what I like, though, is I like Count how the conditional statements. Conditional statements. Yeah. It's, it's, it's like I don't know. Talk to me about this is something that I asked your predecessor about during his term. I asked President Obama, so I'll ask you the same thing. Is there anything, as you look back at your first almost two years, that you regret, that you wish on you, that you could just take back and redo? Well, there would be certain <laughs> things. I'm not sure I want to reveal all of them, but I, I would say tone. Uh, I would like to have a much softer tone. I feel to a certain extent I have no choice, but Three, maybe I do, and four, maybe I could have been softer from that standpoint, but I want to get things done. We've had tremendous victories on trade. We've had tremendous victories on so many different things. What? What does um, that have to do with tone? On our military, you look at what we've done with rebuilding the military, but I would say if there's a <laughs> I think tone would be perhaps something. I'm not sure that if I did that, maybe I'd be swamped. Okay, you know, swamped meaning with the other side, because I wouldn't say that would be something I would uh, say that I'll be working on. <laughs> twelve. I counted twelve. Yeah. There you go. Uh, it's like, I think we might have missed a few. <laughs> it's like when they ask you in a job interview what your biggest fault is, and you're like, mm, too I, much of a perfectionist. My problem I guess. is I work exactly. way too hard, and I just can't let a project go until it's absolutely perfect. <laughs> so sometimes people have a difficult time working with me because I just won't sleep. Right, not I enough. won't stop until everything is absolutely I have some right. Flaws. I, 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 not enough me time. I give too much. I'm too, too much passionate too about making. Making America great again. The problem with me is I just simply won't stop until everybody gets a great fucking deal. <laughs>